And I'm Adam. Welcome to the Movie Preview Review, where we review movies based on only watching their previews. You've gone mad doing a big Oh my. Whoa. It's Radio J. Radio J. It's Adam and Jay in the morning. Going at you. Today. Rush sounds. <laughs> Auga. Auga. <laughs> Uh, today we're going to react, review, and then riff off of the brand new Simon Pegg Nick Frost horror comedy action movie, Slaughterhouse Rules. Is a oh, Z. There a Z? There's a Z at okay. the end there. Or a Z, depending on what country you're watching this I can't this tell in. if I love or hate that. The Z? Yeah. For when they do that to like make things seem Something like... Something out of an S, yeah. Sometimes know. it works. This, I mean, but it's, it's Simon Pegg. They know what they're doing. Maybe it's Z for zombie? All right. Maybe. Did someone pick direct this too? I don't know. Or this kind of screams Edgar Wright to me. Is this Edgar Wright? I don't think so. I don't, we'll see. We'll, we'll, we'll look at, we'll look at it in a minute. Here we go. Did you get my note about the no-go areas? Um, I cannot have pupils wandering about in the middle of the night. These things always end up in a bloody mess. Welcome all to Slaughterhouse. This is the school pecking order. At the top, we have the bat. In the middle, Clemsy Lawrence. Watch where you're looking. And then down at the bottom, Wooten. Who's Wooten? That's Wooten. Hello. <laughs> I'm afraid Mr. Prig will be unable to teach today or ever again. He died here. Alone. Anyway. <laughs> There's something in the woods. What the devil? That hole is a gateway. And it leads straight down to hell. Now, who wants to buy some drugs? They just ate half the upper sink. Now we can blow shit up. Language wouldn't. Children, save yourselves! To the scooter! Hold it! All right, I'm going as fast as Stop I can. Stop it! You're making me nervous! <laughs> Seatbelts, everyone. Stop worrying. What they're gonna do? Eat you alive. <laughs> Delicious. Hmm. Huh. Was that a big mole creature? It looked like a big naked mole rat. It could be a mole rat. There could there seem to be a smorgasbord of evil coming from that sinkhole in the, uh, what's the name of the forest outside of Hogwarts? The, the, for, the, the Magic forbidden forest. forest. The Forbidden Forest. The forest full of, the one that has spiders and centaurs in it. That's right. Spider centaur forest. Mm-hmm. That place. I'm okay with it, uh, it not necessarily being a gateway to hell. I'm okay with it being radioactive moles. I'm fine with that. Oh, sure. Oh, yeah, yeah. It does have, yeah, it does have to be. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's better. <laughs> Less supernatural. Just yeah, we don't need super crazy. Hell Portal. We've done Hell Portal, but radioactive naked mole rats? Yeah. They approve. Had to infect other things, apparently. Assume, maybe. I don't know. I think they kind of were kind of going, like, was that a zombie at the end there? Mm -hmm. Probably not, though. No. I'm being good. Yeah. Like, yeah, radioactive naked mole rats. Can I look up who directed this? Oh, sure. Yeah. yeah. Let's do that real quick. I got the IMDb's up. You're uh, so, you're so you. good. It was uh, written and directed by Crispin Mills. Okay. okay. Crispin Mills. Who yeah, has I... done some of the work in other things. Like? Like? To space and yeah. back. Yes. Uh, Simon, uh, he's worked with Simon Pegg before. <clears throat> and Rogue Trader. And the Winged Boy. Yeah, no. Yeah, yeah, no, no. Um, that's in a whole lot. No. So good for him. Yeah. For directing a movie. Yeah, it looks cool. Big. Yeah, it looks fun. Uh, this reminded me a little bit of much more fun than, oh, what was that movie with Elijah uh, Wood? Uh, Lord of the Rings. Thank you. That one. Yes. Uh, North. No, the one where um, the, the, it's the, the amoebas every, get in everyone's brain and the teachers turn evil and they got to save the school by like, killing them. John Stewart died in the first 15 minutes of the movie and the... It's cool. Dude, I don't know. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, it was like a space amoeba or a space sure. slug. And the, the school gets all uh, the Oh, Sin and, City, yeah. Yep. Elijah Wood's in that one. He is, and he eats a chick. Yep. It's super gross. She eats, oh yeah, uh, Carlo Gugino's fingers. That I didn't like that movie after that moment. That was really gross. 
Uh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, anyways, put st uh, students up against horrible things and teachers and stuff. Isn't it nice that a bunch of big, radioactive, naked mole rats can bring a school together and cross boundaries and let everyone know that everyone is the same and we're all friends? You know, sometimes... I feel like every school should go through, like... A naked mole rat? A, yes. A mutated mole rat infestation? Yeah. yeah. You know, they should all have to Invasion. fight, like, a big monster. Mm -hmm. You know? But, like, first day of school will be like, Hey, Northridge High, you get Sasquatch this year. And it's like, oh, you get Sasquatch. And it's like, I was prepared for vampires. And it's like, oh, Doug, you screwed up, man. <laughs> yes. You gotta bring options. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. But, like, Southridge High, they straight up, they got, they got zombies. Ooh. That was tough. That, they lost half the senior class. Yeah, yeah. They were slacking off. It's their last year. What's gonna happen? We've already done this. Yeah, but it times. was it was wizard controlled zombies, so like they got them back. Even worse. Yeah, but I'm Even saying worse. that he could turn. You know, it's not a disease. It's more of a of a, of a spell. Mm-hmm. So like you know, then he didn't do as good. But like Westridge High, they got a dragon. Yikes. But That's really hard. What kind of dragon? Probably the good thing about Westridge is that they have one of the chosen. Oh, and it, yeah, it took out the dragon like really quick. Problem is, acid blood oh. melted through. They lost the entire South Wing. Yeah, it, it bursts. Yeah, it bursts. And that means like you know half those classes are taking place outside in like the little tents and those little you know and yeah. um those pop up things that mm -hmm. have no air conditioning and it's that's not a good environment to yeah. learn in. It's horrible. In Eastridge High, well. Yeah, what happened in Eastridge High? It's gone. It's, 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 it's gone? A, it's a ghost school now. Oh my god. Yeah, they got a ghost and the ghost took over and now it's all, it's a ghost building with ghost students. Man, poor Eastville yeah. High. It's a ghost. Man. It's all ghosts. <laughs> it's basically like, school is just cabin in the woods. That's exactly where I was thinking. <laughs> like, who went down to the basement? <laughs> And picked up the ghost collar. Damn it. The ghost When are we gonna get a when are we gonna get a Cabin in the Woods 2 though? I mean that movie kind of ended, you know, significantly and like I, yeah, I'm there is I'm no making a prequel, sequel. dude. Oh, or prequel? just or just do oh. honestly, I'm okay with them just like remake Cabin in the Woods, they just picked a different thing. Oh. You know? Possibly also I wouldn't mind seeing or what they happens picked four next. of them and then the monsters fight. Ooh! Let, let them fight. Don't do that. Slaughterhouse rules. Yeah, this looks okay. It looks it looks fine. It looks like it'd probably be fine. I don't. This trailer didn't. The do, trailer didn't do it justice at all. Didn't do a really a great job. Because I was like, I kind of want to see this. Uh, this trailer is making me want to see it less. Yeah. From the tagline, I was like, I'm in. Simon Pegg. Okay, great. Yeah. I don't know. <coughs> yeah, this doesn't seem like a focused trailer. It was more Michael like, Sheen, that's his name? Michael yes, Sheen? Michael yeah. Sheen. Mm -hmm. I was thinking Wesley Snipes the whole time. Uh, what Man, Michael Sheen, what a perfect foil to Simon Pegg's energy. Oh, yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Like, they have a very similar vibe, but they go in totally two different directions. Mm -hmm. It's great. I think that's that's the one thing about this movie I'm more the most excited about, because I, like, I, I was like, I think these two have something that is kind of compelling, and I want to see more of it. Well, I like seeing Michael Sheen in more comedies. He's in. He's very funny. He's very funny. He's in a lots of things. He's very versatile. But I really like him in comedies, because he's very funny. He's very dry. Yeah, he's like the. He's kind of like the nicer, the the good twin to Christoph Waltz. I feel like sometimes. Oh. You know? He's like yeah. Christoph Waltz without the menace. Because that guy's got resting menace face. Wow. Yeah. Just, you. Yeah, you take Michael Sheen, and you cross it, and uh, Michael Sheen is like. Is Charmander, and then uh, who are we just talking about? Oh, wow, it's so early. Oh, Christoph Waltz. Christoph Waltz yeah. is Charmeleon, and then Willem Dafoe is Charizard. <laughs> unexpected Willem Dafoe. Yeah, unexpected Willem Dafoe. Order. I remembered his name this time. You did. And how? And how? Yeah, slaughterhouse rules. Rule number one, always wear eye protection. Yeah, man. I hope it's moles. I really hope it's moles. It would that it would be funny if it was moles. It's way better that way. Mm -hmm. they, I hope they didn't get they don't or maybe or demon moles. Or like a bunch of moles dr 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 dug down to hell and Satan was like, Your industrious creatures, I will make you mine. <laughs> I'm okay with that as well. Ooh. And then yeah, that's a really good uh 
That's really a bad guy. Demonic yeah. hell spawned naked moles. Radioactive too. Radioactive, radioactive naked moles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got we got we got to trade this up to like TMNT, man. This is it's hard to say Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles all the time. So you just gotta. Well, yeah, but it's worth it though. You have to show you have to show respect. Demonic radioactive naked moles. Not to the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Oh, that's true. Well, we used to. Now that new Nick show. Is it that? Is it he's watching it? Is it bad? What's wrong with it? The animation's really suspect, and the character design is uh, rough. Oh, that's a bummer. Also, Raphael, Raphael's a leader. No, and that's just that's not. That's not so what does Leo do? You know, does Leo just like he's like he's a cool guy now? He's a cool guy now. I guess. You don't. Leo's the leader. That's his whole thing. I know. He has the burden of leading the turtles. Splinter gave him that responsibility, and he has to deal with it. It's a, a wildly compelling character choice. Yeah. It is. But not That's this time. stupid. Not in this iteration. All right. You know what? We're... Yeah. yeah. Sla Slaughterhouse rules. Slaughterhouse rules. Coming out this Halloween. Yeah. Yeah. Why not? This movie? Why not? Mm -hmm. Let us know what you guys think the Slaughterhouse rules are, and if you will see this movie. You can yeah. also like, subscribe, hit the bell. Do that YouTube that you do so well. Guacamole is extra, you demonic radioactive mole rats. There you go. Yeah. Uh, yeah, share this video with your exterminator buddies. Yeah. Find out if they know how to get rid sure of Nick Frost. Frost. Yeah. Sure. He's really cool. He yeah, he seems cool. Yeah. Uh, he probably won't survive this movie. No. Uh-uh. Maybe one of It'd the It'd be first weird ones. if he did. Would it? Yeah. He's Nick Frost. He, he wants to die in every movie. He's like, yeah, totally huh. kill me. That's true. But yeah, leave what what uh, what kind of monsters did you have to fight at your school? Yeah, what happened to your school with that? Yeah, uh, did you go to a ghost school? Did the uh, team building demonic fight? Did you have one of the chosen at your high school? If so, what was that like? Leave it in the comments. <laughs> Ooh, it's early. Mm -hmm. First video back. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still on that island time, y'all. You know. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, other videos are popping up for you right now. Please watch those. We would appreciate that as much as we appreciate you for watching this one. Yep. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks. Bye. Bye.